All right, how's it going, everyone? Welcome to Mortal Kombat 2 Remix. This is a Mugen Mortal Kombat game based on purely on Mortal Kombat 2. Uh, and this has been in development for a good number of years, I think. Uh, the guy's YouTube channel is called MK2 Remix, but I think his name goes by the name of Lian or Leandro. Very talented uh, Mugen creator. Uh, it's one of many. There is loads of really talented Mugen creators out there. Leo Cobain Jr., um, Bowie Alves, um, and of course, mm, Borg himself, the man himself, Borg, who, uh, you know, Mortal Kombat Season 2.9 and all the ones prior to it, so we've got them to thank for these amazing Mugen games that we can all play. But I've been looking forward to this one. Round Mortal Kombat 2 is one of my favourites uh, of the 2D era. Uh, one of the best rosters for me. So I've been looking forward to playing this. I'm going to skip this. I'm going to get me settings on it should be on hard eight which is the hardest difficulty you can put it on uh, goes from easy one all the way up to hard eight uh, life at 100 time at 99 put the game speed on fast one because I kind of like a sort of Mortal Kombat trilogy type game speed so and if you're familiar with Mortal Kombat 2 or any of the Mortal Kombat games but I just have fond memories of this in the arcades when I was younger getting absolutely just destroyed by the ridiculous AI that was coded purely to take your coins <laughs> to fucking rid you of all your money. So look at this roster, we've got a couple of extra faces from the default roster, we've got Liu Kang, Kung Lao, you've got Smoke playable in this, uh, Johnny Cage, my boy Reptile, my favourite, Sub-Zero, another one of my favourites, Shang Tsung, Jade, Katana, Jax, got Raiden, Scorpion, another classic character. The, the three main ninjas are my favourites, Reptiles, Sub-Zero and uh, Scorpion. We've got Noob, Cybot, Baraka and Melina. I don't know if you can actually play as the bosses, um, if there's any like uh, unlockables. I've only been beat the game once in a ladder, so I don't know if there's any unlockables to be had, but I'm going to do a play through, a playthrough Reptile. with Reptile. Or I'm going to fucking try to, this is fucking brutally hard, there's no way. I'm getting through this without dropping matches. I'm going to drop a bunch of matches here. <laughs> so just if you sit tight and be prepared to see me get my ass fucking smashed. Like, so I've only beat it once. I haven't spent much time trying to trying to like find out strategies to beat the AI. Combos are key. I mean, the AI is just fucking ridiculous. Wow, well, at least I won the first round anyway. That's a that's a positive start. Fight. Don't be surprised if Baraka just comes back now and just fucking smokes me. Like Reps, Reptiles not got the best combos. Um, Baraka's gonna pull this one back, I think. Just walked into that. Oh, I don't know what happened there. That force ball didn't uh, just kind of did nothing there when it hit. So you would never like. It's like really hard to beat these games by like playing normally, like you know, by doing fucking special moves and shit like that. You have to like exploit the AI, like the AI does to you. You know, this game is notorious for like reading your inputs. still remember that one off the top of my head all the way from all those years ago I had a, 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 cop, a copy of Games Master magazine I used to buy Games Master when I I'd get me pocket money when I was little and I remember we were driving to Wales to go to Landudno to go in the arcades and I was luckily enough that issue of Games Master had uh, a section on Mortal Kombat 2 and it had like the moves written down for the characters and I remember Re Reptiles decapitation it was a back back down low punch and I'm my dad was driving the car, and I, I was in the back, and I was reading the magazine, and it was the first time I'd seen the word decapitation. And I, I, was, I said to my dad in the front, I said, hey dad, what does decapitation mean? And he just looked at my mum as if to say, what the fuck, that, first of all, how did he learn that word? And what the fuck is he reading back there? <laughs> He's like, oh, it means someone gets their head cut off, why? So I'm just studying moves for a game, in case I see it in the arcade. Fucking 
still still remember the move just from that from that that magazine that I have. Just it, I never forgot it. It's just mad how you can just retain some things and get gotta concentrate here. Instead of talking, Sub Zero's kicking the shit out of it. Nice to see the uh, the sprite work. That's oh, at least that's a new move for Sub Zero. There's like, like a jumping knee or a flying uppercut. So the uh, some of the sprite work is, is uh, really nicely done. If you're paying attention, some of the combos that I've been doing with Reptile and some that Sub Zero's been throwing. Some of the sprite work is is like Mortal Kombat three, is Mortal Kombat three combination sprites. So. To put them over onto the MK2 characters is awesome. Fucking hell, look at this AI. Jesus. Oh, what? Like the fact that they've given the ice projectile like that in the air. I mean, look at these fucking combos. Like, it's, he just. He gets you with this ice projectile shitload. Fucking hell, look at this fucking AI, it's absolutely ridiculous. Now I gotta switch on here. <laughs> He's one of the hardest, like, Liu Kang's one of the hardest as well. Sub Zero's another one. Like, harder than the bosses. Like, when I said I'd like. beat the game once, the fucking bosses were easy, like Motaro, uh, Kintaro, and uh, Shao Kahn. They were easier than some of the fighters, but like I say, um, Sub Zero and Liu Kang were probably. Raiden was a bit of a fucking pain in the ass as well. There we go. Sometimes going in for combos against people is is the way, and other times just spamming projectiles. I tend to find if they've got like a like an air move, like like Sub Zero's freeze or Liu Kang's in the air fireball. Combos are kind of like not as successful because they just when I try and jump in to start one, they just fucking do the move and um, and like had a fireball me off, freeze me in the air. I've lost this round. Get him at range again, spamming with shit. Ah, ah fucked up there. Thought I would have landed just past the ice puddle there. We've got the uh, Mortal Kombat Shaolin Monks version of shit. Fuck now, look at those double up. Mortal Kombat Shaolin Monks version of Shao Kahn. Oh, fuck it, I'll try to do his other fatality there. Yeah, that announcer is uh, Shao Kahn from, uh, from Shaolin Monks. Oh, I haven't fought Smoke yet. Uh, First time I've gone up, gone up against him. Like I, the only I came up against him in the uh, first playthrough, but it was like the the question mark box, and I don't know if it was like a bug or something, but like it like the round started and then it faded to black, and then it loaded back in again as the second round, and it said I'd won the first one and it did it twice, so it just like went to faded to black twice and then the fight was over. So I don't know if that was a bug or what. But I thought they had to do like some special requirements or something to fight smoke, but could have just been a bug for all I know. See look at this. Like these sprite animations for like smokes like completely new special moves there and stuff. Can even see him then just went for the fucking for the combo. What is that? Other fatality. Forward, forward, down, I kick. That's kind of what I was doing, but I think I was in the... I was in the wrong position. These fucking rounds are fucking gone it. Back. Like, 
unique victory pose there for smoke as well <coughs> some great sprite work going on Round one. Fight. reptiles combos aren't the best like he's um so i'm just sticking to like his his one combo his air juggle one fucking hell fucking destroyed this round Spokes proven fucking difficult. Round fight. Fuck that combo up as soon as I jumped in there. So wave this round off. Fucking hell. I don't even know what the what I was doing then. There is some really good like Mortal Kombat Mugen players on um, on YouTube who just like make this AI look fucking like child's play. Obviously, because they've spent fucking th the channels are sort of dedicated to like Mugen uh, Mugen Mortal Kombat games, so they know how to like deal with the AI and things like that. This is all my sec only my second arcade ladder I've attempted so. So I had him for a minute then. Nice fatality there. It's kind of like one of his, uh, was it Mortal Kombat 9 where he, he did that? I think that's my favourite of the sort of the modern Mortal Kombats as well, the 3D Mortal Kombats, Mortal Kombat 9. It's like the reboot of the series. It's uh, all the characters, got all my favourite characters in that, or like the favourite roster. And it's the sort of the last Mortal Kombat game with like sexy women in it, you know what I mean? Like barbarian type costumes and shit and that's the, that's what I think of when I think of Mortal Kombat violence and fucking the way they were like skimpy fucking fight fight equipments and stuff like that. It was always about like sex and violence for me, Mortal Kombat back in the day. So that was sort of the last great game before it sort of got a bit like fucking squeaky clean and fucking we were getting like fucking Facebook fatalities with like fucking Cassie Cage and they all had quippy little fucking Avengers type lines just before they were about to fight and Mortal Kombat 9 fucking started that bullshit unfortunately. They have little quips before the fucking fight starts. And obviously because the Avengers is just fucking worshipped by a load of fucking people and that quippy um, like dialogue between the characters. Fucking embarrassing. It's like every film gets made and it's the same. The, f the film that they did it best in was Guardians of the Galaxy, and then Marvel realised it was like a like a winning fucking formula just because Chris Pratt was so entertaining. They were like, let's put it in every film. Let's make every Marvel movie with quippy fucking cutting fucking dialogue. Fucking hell, smokes fucking. Might not be going any further here. Fucking smokes fucking got me locked out. Invisibles fucking do me in so of course it's pointless me doing it because the fucking AI just knows where I am all the time. It's only good against human players. Will we get past this fight? I mean I'm here for the long haul. If this takes an hour, <laughs> if this takes two hours, I will fucking act I will do this. I will not quit. Doesn't matter how many times I lose. There you go, you're not getting a fucking flawless. 
Almost. I had a bit of shit start there, but came back. It's giving me some fucking problems. This one's a fucking over. Okay, we can add smoke to the list now of people who have struggled with. Round one. Fight. Spam that shit. Bloody hell, what happened there? Watch him come back and just fucking let smoke me now. Watch this. Just rounds another right off. Fucking hell, that move's super fucking annoying. Excellent. Oh, I had to try to jump over him and go for a combo. Round three. <laughs> Oh. Oh. That fucking kick was gonna land. That's it. Ah, oh, that was the closest we've come. Get him. Just wanna lose track of him when he goes invisible, that's the only fucking problem. Through that sweep out there, then hoping that he just walk onto that. Brand new fatality there for Reptile as well. Awesome look on fatality, nice sprite work. Round one. Fight. Fucking hell, Johnny Cage is another handful as well, actually. <laughs> look at that. Fucking already fucking beat me pretty much. It was a bad start to that. Didn't even know what had happened and I'd lost fucking three quarters of my health. Tends to counter you a lot with that fucking shadow uppercut. Sometimes that fort has that just got like a, a limited range on it? Like, it just doesn't want it hit sometimes, does it? Kind of just like 
explodes in front of him, but it doesn't hit. What's happening with Garaka as well? Right? Just fucking jumped into that like a fucking spaz. The counter with Banner Law. Superior. Ah, <laughs> fucking hell. Put one more hit and he was done. That no, wasn't too bad, that one. <laughs> Should be connected there. Like that. What's going on here? Fuck. Kind of threw me a bit that that force ball just uh, just not hitting. Loves countering with that. That uppercut when you try and jump in for combos. Ooh, just got a couple of hits in there. That force ball, shouldn't I really? And sliding it like that. Yeah, that's that should be hitting. That. That, when, I, when I played other Mugens, that's that's not happening. Oh, of course, he was going to do the high one. I feel like just spamming this is the way to go. Try and jump over with a combo, maybe. Oh, there's the nut punch. Still the fucking same bullshit with that uppercut in it from the, from the olden days. The AI can, if you try and do an uppercut, the AI will just duck immediately. <laughs> fucking counts you with its own uppercut. It way back on the arcade, that shit was happening as well. A gamble there, thought the high one was coming out. High, high force, but. There it is again, that bullshit. Really annoying how that's not connected. That needs fucking sorting out. That doesn't. You should be getting hit with that. Like it's it's touching him as he's in the middle of doing a move. I 
if I can get him to do that. Force ball after every combo like that. at least punish him every time he does the force ball. Fuck me. Just gave that fucking round away there. I don't know what happened there. Just totally lost focus. It tends to happen after a win around. Like I just dropped the next one fucking by default. Yeah, yeah, just fucking just get a free round back. This fight's over. Totally lost me focus there after that first round. Clean in the blood. Oh, just threw me in the middle of a fucking uppercut. Finger off the block. the end of that fight. <laughs> it's fucking over already. Look how quickly. Unreal. Okay, now. It'll just be a Terminator one round and then the next round you'll just do damage on it and other times it just won't allow you to hit it. And I got away from punishing it with the slide there, didn't I? I've only just fucking remembered. Can have some spit in your face, you cunt. Is he gonna go into some fucking overdrive now? Get on them spikes, you twat. Fucking stay up there. I'm not doing the thing where you slide down them, you can stay up there. Fatality. Oh, here we go. Fucking hell. Gonna get locked down on Scorpion for a while now. Air throw, teleport, punch, spear, the usual bollocks from Scorpion. Oh, fuck. It started off alright. 
settle in. This is going to take a while. Ellie always does that after a combo, after he blocks a combo. You're gonna get fucking speared. You know. My mind's gone, I don't even know what to do there, just kind of deer, the deer in the headlights kind of thing happening. Need to sort of figure him out a little bit. Oh, sorry. Like, combo onto the acid spit there, but there's a bit of a delay, like, after the combo. So normally I like to use the force ball. But there's not enough time. I think you can do that on other Mugans, but it looks like the timing's been changed on this one. No, you definitely can't connect with that. Stick to the basics. Spit, force ball, slide. One combo. Or oh, get him to do it like that. Jump over him. Uh, jump over the spear and go in for the combo. Let's see how that I can repeat that. I'm gonna get fucking smoked here though, probably. off this round, isn't it? Fucking hell. <laughs> See what I mean? How it does that? It, like, sm smashes you after you've, like, fuck around against it. Oh, got me that time. Weird, Alex. Sometimes that was working, and then other times it's not. Fuck that air throw. I forgot about that. Smash around. Oh, come on. Gotta press the block button, dickhead, otherwise he's gonna hit you. Ah! 
Get in that fucking acid. Wins. Fatality. Is that toasty enough for you? Oh god, is Melina fucking hell? She's gonna be jumping side bullshit. Too bad. I was expecting like teleport kicks there and ASI counters. Phenomenal. Um, it's my friendship. I've done a fr back, back, down, low kick. Can that be done from any range? Press low punch instead of low kick. Oh, never mind. Looks like meat's back on the menu, boys. Oh, for fuck's sake. She got that move where she evades your projectiles. Jade is always a pain in the ass to deal with in old school Mortal Kombat games. Of course, we got the uh, Shaolin monks. Mortal Kombat Shaolin Monk soundtrack on some of these stages as well. This is like Goro's, Goro's Lair soundtrack. Wish these remake Shaolin Monks. That was a really like great game. That love like a HD remake of that game. Rounds of right off. I know on some Mugans there's a stage fatality here on Goro's Lair, so. If I, if I can beat it, I'll, uh, I'll try and do it. If it. Even if it is, it might not even have a stage fatality. Just miss with a high kick. Uh, fuck it, we'll do his friendship. What's this? <laughs> like a baboon there? It's like one of his old school. Uh, it's old school friendship. Uh, was that like an animality that one in one of his one of the old games? He turned into a baboon. Oh fucking hell! Is fucking Liu Kang? I'll be here all night trying to do this. Like a modified bicycle kick there, which is a bit of a pain to deal with. Looks like you can do it in the air as well. Okay, not a bad start. He's gonna fucking smash me now, though, you watch. Oh, got him. This other one again. I like this one. Mirror match. Round one. 
See that like uppercut there at the end? That's like a Mortal Kombat 3 uh, animation there. And it's just great that they've been added into the Mortal Kombat 2 sprites. And of course, if you remember, remember rightly, Mortal Kombat 2 didn't even have combinations. That was only introduced in Mortal Kombat 3. So it's just good seeing the MK2 sprites getting the uh, sort of more in line with the Mortal Kombat 3. And it's, you know, Mugen creators have been doing that for a while now. It's nothing new, but I just, I always like to see it because the ninjas are my, have always been my favourite characters. And just seeing them have like nice combos and shit, you know. Just really like it. Doing too bad. How long's it taking me? 44 minutes. Or around the 40 minute mark we're recording for. It's only about fucking an hour and a half. Or maybe two hours. On my first run. Maiden's always a fucking handful because he's got this fucking backwards fucking lightning. Of course, he's got the teleport. He's got. So I might be here for a while. <laughs> Gives me a few problems, this Raiden. Quicker than that, he beat me to it. Concentrate so much. That fucking Superman just does so much fucking damage. Oh, what the fucking just might have fucked up, Royal. Get down there. Suppose it messed up there, sliding underneath him like that, but I managed to get him. Kung Lao. Round one. What the fuck? See, this is what happened when I was talking to you about the smoke fight. It, when we got to the question mark. What the fuck? So, okay, I'll, I'll see, it's the question. I don't know if something bugged on that, like... It happened last time as well. I 
don't know if you've got to do something special there to get past that, like it's something I'm not doing. Like it's a... Like it's a secret fight or something, but it's just Kung Lao, you know what I mean? It's like... If that was like a secret character or something, you know, like a Jade or a... Or like a smoke fight, I could... But, like, I don't know what's happening there. I, I don't know if that's been... Coded correctly or what, but... I think I have seen some people mention it in other videos that that's happened to them as well. No, oh, fucking destroyed him there. Round three. Fight. Background there. This is the end of you. Once we get past the uh, Shang Tsung, it should be a. Uh, if we get past him, fucking hell. Should be a lot easier. The bosses were way easy, I thought. The fuck are you laughing at? I think that's funny, dude. Shang, fucking have some of that. Your soul is mine. So, from what I remember with Kintaro, crush him, Kintaro. It was combos for Kintaro. Look how easy that was. That's shocking. Oh, the sub boss is easier than the regular roster. And that's that. Kintaro done in the first try. That's too easy. <clears throat> I won't beat Shao Kahn on the first try, but... You are nothing. We've got a green palace, Shao Kahn. Shao Kahn. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Not gonna get him on the first try, unfortunately. <clears throat> Fatality? Oh, I want to see his fatalities. He's got some good ones. <clears throat> I win. Should start playing more Mugen Mortal Kombat. I've got a bunch of them on my laptop. Like, and most of the time, I just like putting it on AI versus AI and letting on the hardest setting. 
You're just watching the AI just fucking destroy itself. So it's like really entertaining to watch. Fuck, fucked up there, should have stayed at the distance. Me there when he closed it on me. You are finished. Come on, let's see if we can get this done in under an hour. An hour. That'll be Im impressive for me. Better. Just gonna keep doing those moves if he just wants to charge forward. Get it with the uppercut. No. Sonya in the background. Reptile wins. Shao Kahn's rule is over. You once again, you are the supreme Mortal Kombat warrior. Minamoto. That's saying my speakers are in the way. Yoshinsu. Don't know what that means. All right. Thanks very much for watching that, everyone. I'll leave the link. Uh, in the description to Leanne's channel uh, or MK2 Remix's channel if you go there and you check the description of his video you'll find a, a download link for this you don't have to pay for it um, it's completely fine there's no viruses or nothing like that you can just download it and just run it and play this awesome game for nothing so check the link in the description if you're interested and uh, I'm going to leave it here thanks very much for watching I'll see you in the next one